hello welcome to my channel finding my style my name's kim and i'm new to youtube i've been on here probably this is my third week um i've done really well um at the moment um for subscribers um it's something mary is it mary jo helen helen mary jo she touched on people are a bit nervous about subscribing because i think that it costs them money but it doesn't i used to think that myself um i used to think if i subscribe i've got to pay um so it's it's free to subscribe if you hit the um the bell notification so that you'll get all notifications when i upload a video apparently that brings um my video when i bring one out to your attention um otherwise if you don't you, you won't get notified and you won't know if i do another one but um today i'm decluttering my tops i woke up this morning and i felt i felt all right the sun was shining and then i could feel my mood going down you know um i looked in my wardrobe and it's just a mess um with all clothes and you know i didn't think i'd got that many when i see the other ladies um because my clothes are all in one wardrobe i see the other ladies and i think how much they've got in their wardrobe but look i've hung all my tops up and i've got a lot and as i say i look in my wardrobe and i just feel as though i've got nothing to wear uh, so I'm going to go through it now with you and I am going to be strict. <laughs> what I'd like to know as well, what do you fold up and keep in drawers and what do you insist on hanging? I know you shouldn't hang uh, wall knits up because apparently they grow on hangers. Um, probably they do unless it, you want them to grow. If you've got a little short top and you'd like it a bit longer, that wouldn't grow. Um, but uh, yeah and for a start i showed my friend at work gave me these um so you put your um stuff on so you put one two three four five six hangers on and then you let them go like that so they'll sit like that i'm going to try that for my band t-shirts because i've got quite a few band t-shirts i've only got a few hung up here what i've worn throughout the winter but i've got another hamper full of uh, spring summer clothes that I need to go through as well but as it is for now I want to sort my wardrobe out as it is so I'm going to be strict um, for definite I've, some of my sweatshirts are inside out because uh, that's how I wash them so uh, I fold them like that but I find folding sweatshirts they um, they crease terrible I don't iron them um because i don't need it and this is a sweatshirt that says i am beautiful uh loved and worthy and strong see but i don't feel this color does anything for me for some reason I, it's one of them colors i don't feel any good in so i think i'm gonna sell this um i'm not gonna put it back in my wardrobe i'm not gonna take them off the hangers for now leave them on hangers yeah so i think i'm gonna get rid of that one um i do like it but not on me this is another ho hoodie i know uh, hoodies i'm not comfortable in hoodies either now this one says um uh drink life while it's busy there uh, um so I'm, i think i'm gonna get rid of that as well because as i said i don't feel comfortable and at the minute i'm feeling is if i don't make an effort with myself if i don't do my hair if i don't put makeup on um i just feel yuck um i know some ladies don't i had an old makeup day the other day and i just felt shit really all day long whereas i've put my face on today i've done my hair and I feel better for it. So I think we get to a, an age where you've got to make effort, haven't you? For, and it's for yourself, nobody else. This is obviously staying on my wardrobe. That was one of my new purchases. This was size six, but it fits me as a 14 in um, m and sale. So that's staying. I'm hoping to see some 
room on here as i say some things will stay this was no uh navy and white um my daughter bought me that so that's staying got a, got it in black as well um so what i like about these is the detail on the back they're a slightly thicker um long sleeve top but they are nice I bought this pre-loved but I'm not sure it's really me so it's nice but I, like looking at all these tops I've got to be ruthless um some things have got to go so I think that's gonna have to be one of them that t-shirt I've only just bought that uh, I think I'll hang on to it for now and see so keep that one there is a couple of dresses in here as well this is too big on me so that's gonna go um it's so light as well that's um by miller miss millie that's gonna go i haven't worn that i don't know why i bought it i bought it pre-love so this is my vera moda t-shirt um, I haven't worn any of this new stuff yet and it's because I can't see what I've got so I think I do need to declutter this is another colour that I'm not feeling it in either and it's another one with um, the I am loved on so I think that's got to go as well shame but I, it's just not me now I quite like this blouse so I think that needs to stop I think that'll be nice for with white jeans and it is nice with jeans as well so that's an m &S. I bought that off Vinted so that's the blouse let's see if I can keep things together I think this will be handy for spring it's like a, a shacket type one now, I think it'd be nice with white jeans or jeans. So I'm going to keep this for a bit longer. Again, I bought this pre-loved. And if it doesn't feel right at the time when I uh, wear it, I'll get rid of that. This is a dress that I'm going to wash now and put away for winter. This was just an F&F &F dress and it felt so nice on. Um, so I do like it and I am going to keep that one. Oh, that's that uh oh this is um a sweatshirt that's this is inside out but it's got like the liberty print on the inside again i've washed it inside out so that's obviously keeping that was off my son off his uh son and his uh partner and so it'd be off my granddaughter really another knit here um so i'm gonna wash that for uh, winter and put it away all the walls have got to come bought this from H&M this is gorgeous on um, there's a lot of these about isn't there oh is that bit of that needs pushing in I'll try and push that in um, yeah this is lovely on this is really dressy as well um, so obviously that's staying um, another winter knit that can uh, be washed and put away for winter another long sleeve top this one was off my daughter as well for mother's day so that's going to come in handy i'll keep that on um, uh, this was off my son so basic navy um, t-shirt that's going to be useful as well so oh and he bought me this one and his um other half kaylee that's that one so they're staying um and then another striped t-shirt black and uh ecru really like that so i think that's me done for um stripes really i don't think you should buy any more 
ones to put the knitwear and the sweats there. Um, this t-shirt, I actually love this one on. My friend did this um, and I actually like this, so that's staying. This one was off Paper Lily and it's my birth sign. Somebody asked, I'd got a white sweatshirt on with a star on. They asked me where that was from and it is Paper Lily Designs and she did that one as well. So that's staying. This one, uh, I like it, but will I wear it? Not sure, to be honest. So I am going to put that in the, the to-go pile. Um, this one, I haven't reached for this for ages. Um, should I keep it? Mm, I'm not sure. Not sure about that one. Might put it in the to-go pile. Or should I keep it? No, it's going to go because I haven't reached for it. Now, I've got two tops now uh, striped, so I don't need another one. So that's got to go. This is a winter thing. I bought this from Pull and Bear. I've worn it once. I'm not going to get any wear out of it in the spring. It's like a foul leather jacket. So I'm going to put that away for winter. I have a striped t-shirt here. This is a Ralph, Ralph Lauren one. Um, so that's going to come in handy, isn't it? There. Another blouse. I'm not sure if I'm going to reach for that one either. So that's got to go. So that's that one. Um, somebody sent me this as a secret. Uh, secret. Secret Santa. <laughs> uh, on, in the pre-love world. But I'm not really a cardigan person as such. So I think that's going to have to go. Um because it's a shame to hang on to it when somebody else could wear it. I know it's that colour that goes with a lot. Um, maybe I should hang it back up and, and see if I do get to wear it. So, that's that. Somebody uh, sent me this because I liked it. It's got hearts on. Um, I have worn it and it does feel good on, so maybe I'll keep this one. Um, I've got two pink sweatshirts here, that one and this hoodie, so I think one, I now need to have two, so I'll keep that one, because um, that's another one of them, it's like I had a job lot, oh no, this has got writing down the sleeves, it's like I had a job lot with these, uh, <laughs> didn't I, and I mean that was quite expensive from a company called Person Personally Positive, um, it's another small business and she, I just kept buying them. So uh, I think that needs to, I can keep that. This is a sports top. So I was thinking all my sports stuff can be folded up. I'm back on my fitness next week. I just do YouTube um, videos. Um, I like, I think is it Fitness with Rick? something like that and he does like the walking videos in uh, what you can do in the living room that's just a fitness top to put on if you nip out you go for a long walk and these are my fitness things uh, i've got my leggings and this is an ed sheeran top and my sports bra so that they can go separate another band t-shirt we went to simu's me and my daughter so that's that that can go on one of those hangers black jumper this is the softest jumper ever this is a marks and spencers and it just felt lovely on that can be washed and put away guns and roses that was from um, stradivarius um so that's that one all 
although this felt nice on I don't know if it actually suits me um I'm thinking it could be all right with my um cream jeans off-white jeans if not um I don't know felt really nice on but it, people told me it looked nice but I didn't feel right it, it's gonna go now that obviously is stopping that's a Alice Claiborne white shirt and that's obviously a staple so I'm keeping that and then I'm getting stuck so that's that one it's another paper lily t-shirt uh, so I'm going to keep that one there this is a nice jumper it's thick um pre-loved so i'm going to wash that and that can go away another sweatshirt uh this is a nice one it's got the writing down the um sleeves again from personally positive so i'll keep that another cardigan i don't feel comfortable in cardigans really um this one's got the hood on and this is slightly big on me so i think it needs to um i need to move it on really it's hanging up there and somebody else could love it better than i could i need to stop buying things for the sake of it this is a another knit this is an m s so that's going to be washed and put away. Ed Sheeran. We saw him in Cardiff. So I'm keeping that. Vest tops. I have got more than one vest top. But it's alright under like these shirts. So that's keep, keeping that. This is like um, a knit poncho. I think that's alright. I have a, a light t-shirt. So I'm going to keep that one and this is like a long jacket oh. um, I don't know I could keep this maybe out for a bit longer might wear it um, in the spring over a t-shirt and jeans and trousers smart and it's quite weighty but at the same time it's not too heavy that I couldn't wear it again so that's, I've done okay there really, haven't I? So, move it along and spread it out. Still looks more than I thought I've got, to be honest. But to be fair, I had um, bought some things out of um, my wardrobe, uh, my drawers and hung them up. So I have decluttered a bit and it is looking a bit better. At least I can see what I've got. So, so yeah, let me know what you hang and what you fold. Um, personally, I, everything I fold, it gets creased. So um, either I'm folding it wrong or I don't know what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> so uh, let me know. Um, what else? Oh, can I give... Linda T, Linda T seventy, I think. Linda seventy, Linda T seventy gave me a shout out on her um, video the other day. Um, so if you want to give her a, a follow, or, or well, should I say, subscribe, hop on over to her channel, and she does um, lifestyle videos, clothes, and um, pretty much the same as what a lot of us do. Um, so give her a follow um and also what i've got coming up i've got i bought a few things from new look um so i want to show you those and i've bought some wax melts from daisy blue stocked up with those so i'll, I'll do an unboxing for those and i've still got my bottoms to go so i've done my tops um so it's all my bottoms when Nana P said about, I don't know if I've said this on another video, so if I have, sorry for repeating myself. Um, but she said about sorting her pants out. 
um, and down here in the Midlands we don't call them pants we call them trousers or jeans or whatever um, but uh, I thought she was going to sort her underwear drawer out on the uh, screen I thought oh I'll have to see this <laughs> but now pants as in bottoms so a bit clearer now so thank you for watching if you've enjoyed this video leave me a comment um, and any uh, decluttering tips that you've got yourself let me know I'm always grateful to hear I love a decluttering video myself um, it, it just it declutters me but I am desperate desperately needing decluttering and um, it's just getting on top of me um, seeing loads of stuff and what I've got to stop buying I, I've got a white t-shirt there now any other white tops I've got to stop buying I'm thinking that's a nice top I'll get another white top I've got to stop that um, I've got enough white tops I mean I have got enough of everything really if anything it'll be bottoms that I need and I desperately need dresses so um, so yeah so thank you for watching I know a rabbit but um once you get started uh, you can talk for England and I'd never thought I'd be able to talk to myself like I do um, but uh, yeah thank you for watching ladies see you on the next video bye